for a long time, Daniel Cormier applied his trade as a heavyweight there. Whether it's in wrestling or in mixed martial arts, his drive, determination, and work ethic has proved to be a devastating combination. All right, so here he is, the number one heavyweight contender, making the walk to the octagon here tonight. He is challenging the champion, whom he has bad blood with, whom he believes he is better than. And obviously, as he makes the walk here tonight, big position to become the new champion of the world. As he steps into the octagon right now, he steps in with a champion's mind. Or till the take for this, our main event of the evening. Cormier is three years his senior. Miocic is five inches taller. He will have an eight-inch reach advantage. Now for the official introductions, here's Bruce Buffer. This is a fight that we have been looking forward to for a long time and is about to take place right now. I'm very excited. All right, here we go. Up for grabs tonight. The Excellent. Working from the mountain crucifix. as he looks to improve position here. Transitioning here on the ground. He's moved to half guard here. His opponent pressed up against the cage. He lands a huge elbow to the head. He's established mounted crucifix. Mijic getting work from the Getting himself into a position to attack with the Americana. He's got control of that arm. He's got the arm locked in. He's got it. Now he wants to lift that elbow up. And he gets out. I thought he was going to have to tap. Wow. And he switches his stance yet again. Nice jab on the heavyweight beach. Brittany Palmer is in the building. Daniel Cormier is a former Olympic. Now it moves into full guard. Now he moves to his back. Oh, look at that. Good punch. Elbow there and another one. Oh, right hand is there for him, Joe. Well, he was a little bit lackluster. He is clearly in big, big trouble here. Oh, he might be out. job of blocking things here. And he connects there. Fainting with that kick. And her line, it's almost as if...
excellent movement on the ground here, always trying to better his position. for his opponent, multiple knockdowns there. Big, big round from Miacic. A huge round. His opponent was in deep, deep water, but through conditioning and willpower, managed to make it out alive. Here we see a devastating punch that results in a knockdown. Ariane Celeste is holding it down. Here we go, third round of this championship fight. That last round was absolutely insane. If this round gets off to anything like that, can keep this in a clinch situation, though, the better. Miacic is able to get the underhook here. in half guard here. Working on a single leg here. Oh, that's some wrestling right there. Well, just because you're on your back doesn't mean you can't throw offense. Stay busy here. You like to see that. It's in half guard. All right, that's three rounds in the books. We are headed to the championship records. You can really see how awesome that round was by these highlights. Ariane Celeste in the building as usual. We have arrived at the fourth round fight schedule for five, five minutes. Our fourth round is underway, and now is where you really see what a fighter is made of. The Ocic appears wobbly. Level change there, goes for the takedown. Back into side control once more. DC looking for a choke. It looks like he's got the north-south choke locked in nice and tight. He got free of the choke. here on the ground. Cormier's lower jaw very swollen now. Time to bite down on the mountains and go forward. Beautiful timing with the left hand. Nice elbow. Back to the feet. Well, this is exactly the sense of urgency you're looking for. Try to take the... These guys are just standing in front of each other and throwing bombs. Let's take a look at that again. Let's see it one more time. Ariane Celeste on hand as usual. It is the fifth and final round. Seminal moment for him here tonight as he gets the huge knockout victory that could hold up as one of the better knockouts of the year. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Mergliata has called a stop to this contest at 45 seconds of round number five. Declaring the winner by knockout and still the undisputed UFC heavyweight champion of the world. Hey, Mio,
So some UFC history tonight as we crown a new UFC champion. Congratulations to fighter and team. And man, are they going to enjoy this one. A lot of people not giving them a chance coming in here tonight. And this is a moment that at times people just thought we wouldn't see. New champion.